We knew this was going to happen eventually. We just didn't know when, but the time is now once again. The repeat abandoned cars have returned. The dreaded repeat abandoned cars. So this is good news for anyone who may have just recently gotten Need for Speed Payback. But anyone who has had the game that's been keeping up with these abandoned cars every single week, don't worry, I feel your pain. It sucks dealing with the same cars over and over, but it's hard to please everybody, I guess, right? So you just saw the location of the new abandoned car, or possibly the new abandoned car, depending on if you have it yet or not, but it just came out today on Tuesday, September 25th. You're gonna have until next Monday, which is, wait, wait a minute. October 1st, oh my god, oh, October already. <laughs> September 25th to October 1st is when you're going to be able to get La Katrina's Nissan Fair Lady 240ZG, which is race spec level 203. So, here's the thing though, it, it, as you probably know if you got it the first time around, it is actually in a different location, which... I think that's nice. At least switch it up. Don't make it just the same location, same car. Oh man, in the beginning with those first six abandoned cars, that was so, so boring, so annoying, but it is what it is. We're past that. They, you know, they stepped it up a little bit. They're not being as lazy. They're actually switching locations, and they did give us a lot of new abandoned cars. Some iconic ones, some cars from the bosses in Payback, and it's pretty cool. This one I actually really like. I love the paint job on it. And I love the car. It's just I have it already. And the thing is, too, the original one we got was also race spec level 203. So they did not change the class. They didn't change the level of the car. It's all the same. Just it's found in a different location this week. So this was the first new one that originally came out, if I remember correctly. Maybe I'm wrong on that. I can't remember for sure. But I'm pretty sure this was one of the first new ones that came out after they had been repeating the same cars for, like, ever. So... Nice to see that, you know, they gave us a lot of new ones. Hopefully we'll get more brand new abandoned cars in the future, but for anyone who hadn't played Payback for a while or just got Payback, this will be new for you. So wanted to make sure I shared with you the location of it so you can quickly and easily find it, even if you're short on time, don't have time to look around for it, whatever the case might be. So really hope this location guide helps all of you out, makes you aware of this new abandoned car in Need for Speed Payback, and final thing, look at all the takedowns I'm getting with a race spec. I gotta say, this cop pursuit, it was easy, it was pretty easy overall. Now the cops were a little tough, luckily I didn't get kill switched, but for me personally, this was an extremely easy pursuit, and you know that I've been having some tough weeks with these abandoned cars, so this was pretty nice, it only took about 2 minutes and 30 seconds, and yeah, that's about it, so I really hope again that this helps everyone out, thanks for watching, I'm out of here. Peace, guys. Nice car you found there.